Good morning, how's it going? Well, I was up late last night because it was Oscars night, the Academy Awards. You don't go to bed early on Oscars night, especially when I had to be up rooting for La La Land. Oh my gosh, what a great movie. And at the end, stop, at the end of the Oscars, the very last announcement was a major snafu. They initially announced La La Land as the movie of the year, and it was wrong. It was actually Moonlight, which I haven't seen yet. I imagine it's a really good movie, and I'll have to watch it. But mm, it turned out that my movie didn't win. So we'll have to see um, the other movie and be sure that I agree with that choice. But Snafu is one word I want to share with you today because... That is, it's letters that represent words. Situation normal, all fouled up. The F can represent a nastier word that for most Americans um, who are educated at all is a very offensive word. But um, we say fouled just to make it acceptable. Okay, so situation normal, all fouled up, snafu, was a major snafu. The word today that we're going on, on the list for the difficult to pronounce words, the word today is deterioration, and it's a, <laughs> a breaking down or um, rotting. When something breaks down, it rots. Like if I have a piece of fruit that goes bad, it deteriorates, it rots, it goes through a level of deterioration. Deterioration. I think the difficulty is from the beginning to the end. There are things that are confusing about that word. And I didn't look up to see what it is in Portuguese. I can imagine that it could be something very similar. But anyway, those are my things for today that will hopefully help you. Let me know um, if you have things that I can help you with, if you have any questions. You see the sun rising behind me. See that huge house across the street from me. Um, I think it's going to be a good day. Make it a good one, okay? And um, thanks for your time. And if there's anything I can do, let me know, okay? Beijão.